New tonight, Bernalillo County District Attorney Sam Bregman is bringing the very tough conversation of guns in our schools directly to our kids. Today, Bregman spoke to students at Washington Middle School. Monica Legrano was there for his latest stop within APS. Monica, this of course is the same school that dealt with a deadly shooting more than two years ago now. That's unfortunately right, Julie. In 2021, Juan Saucedo Jr. shot Benny Hargrove six times, killing him. That shooting and others is why District Attorney Sam Bregman says he's having a no-nonsense talk with kids. It's well known that schools are gun-free zones, but far too often we've seen firearms end up in the hands of students. It's an issue District Attorney Sam Bregman is trying to combat. There is nothing more scary, nothing more of a nightmare than for a parent to think that there's a gun on campus. And so we're going to do everything we can, and we won't always know the results of how effective this was. But if we stop one child from bringing a gun on campus, it'll be worth it. The DA has visited several schools as part of his community anti-gun at schools initiative. And on Wednesday, Bregman came to Washington Middle School, where 13-year-old Benny Hargrove was shot and killed by his classmate, Juan Saucedo Jr., just two years ago. The 14-year-old suspect pleaded no contest to a second-degree murder charge and will stay in custody until he's 21. Bregman reminded students that one decision could impact the rest of their lives. When you make terrible choices, like playing around with firearms or guns, the consequences can be so hurtful to other people and they can destroy your own life. He also made it clear age won't stop his office from prosecuting people who break the law. I don't care if they're 14 years old or 40 years old. If you have a gun on campus that is against the law, there is zero tolerance. There are no guns allowed on a school campus. Bregman emphasized having straightforward conversations with students, not to scare them, but to make them realize just how dangerous guns can be. It's something Washington Middle School principal Modessa Hernandez agrees with. I appreciated the no nonsense take on it because they're getting it our anyways. That you know, there is nothing sweet and you know, soft about TikTok. They're getting the real ugly truth out there and there's nobody clearing it up. And I think it's about time that we step up and start taking that position. DA Bregman is planning on visiting a Trisco Heritage Academy High School tomorrow to talk to students there. It comes a little over a month after a student, Adrian Martinez, accidentally shot and killed his friend, Elijah Paul Morphin. Tessa, Julie. All right, Monica, thank you.